there's no scientific evidence to prove that cranial sacral therapy helps anything or helps tinnitus. This is something I come up against quite a lot. When you're doing medical research, it's incredibly rigorous and setting up research programs take a lot of money, a lot of incredibly hard professional work. And the British Cranial Sacral Therapy Association are carrying out rigorous research programs as we speak. So watch this space. It's not the easiest thing to prove. In the meantime, I encourage people to try cranial sacral therapy out for yourself. If you have tinnitus or if you have aches or pains, if you have a stress-related symptom in your body, rather than waiting for men in white suits to write some report in the Lancet or some medical journal, um, which may take years, it might be useful for you to just trundle down to your local cranial sacral therapist and try it out for yourself and see if it works because by far the most important evidence we have is people getting better cranial sacral therapy helped my tinnitus back off i've helped lots of people's tinnitus back off i've been promoting cranial sacral therapy for years and all around the world, every week, I get emails from practitioners saying thank you for the referrals, or I get messages from people who have tried cranial work and said, thank God I tried this, it's really helped me. And, you know, thanks, it's um, incredibly beneficial work. It's a very uh, harmless, calming, natural way of working with people that helps them get better. If you are in this mental mindset that says, because there's no scientific evidence to prove that cranial work works, this is an idea that's waiting for a very rigorous program of research, researchers to get out there and prove that something as complicated as a human being can be influenced with cranial work. Please bear in mind that People often watch my YouTube videos and often they say, gosh, my tinnitus got a bit better because the videos calm them down, help them get some sense, help them get a handle on it. That caused their fear response to come down, which in turn caused the alarm bells to stop ringing. Tinnitus is absolutely connected with fear and anxiety and stress danger and when you come out of these states and drop into a much calmer more settled place hey presto the bells stop ringing they quieten down this is not magic this is straightforward physiology you when you feel safe and calm and in a good place it's very common for your tinnitus to relax and if you go and see a good therapist doesn't matter if they're a reflexologist, a hypnotherapist, a cranial sacral therapist. We professionals can help you feel safe, calm and relaxed enough for your system to switch off and your tinnitus gets better. This is the best evidence there is. People getting better. I get quite cross when people say there's no scientific evidence. I say, well... Hopefully we'll get scientific evidence one day. But in the meantime, why not read the thousands and thousands of positive testimonials? Look at the Tinnitus Talk Forum. Don't look at the negative pages. Don't, if you have a negative mindset, Tinnitus doesn't work. You'll go onto the Tinnitus Forum. Um, and you'll see all the negative comments there. If you have a spark of positive, uh, helpful, healthy uh, thinking in you, you'll go to the positive stories section of Tinnitus Talk or the British Tinnitus Association website, all the various associations all around the world. And not surprisingly, if you look for positive stories, you'll go to the positive section of the forums and find all of the, the, the positive case histories of people getting better. 
This is actually the way of the world. Negative mindset will find negative stuff out there. On the internet, if you have a positive approach, you will find helpful information on the internet. Please be careful of anxious thinking that puts you onto the internet and connects you with doom, gloom and terror. This is not going to help you. If you want to get better, find out from people who have got better and read the positive testimonials out there. It's incredible. I've spoken to the directors of these forums and I said, you, I personally said, gosh, you're giving quite a sort of a negative um, impression there. Um, where's all the positive stuff? They said, we're not giving a negative impression. Go and look at the positive section. So I had to learn myself that actually, if you want to get positive, constructive advice, you need to look for that. And if you get blocked because you're waiting for scientific evidence for something that so clearly helps millions of people every day or thousands, tens of thousands of people every day, please wait and I hope you get that information and eventually you may be inspired to get help that helps you. So your own experience is the most important thing. What helps you get better are things that help your mind switch off and help your nervous system relax, things that help take your mind off symptoms like tinnitus. This is going to help. So please be aware of your own approach. How healthy is your mind? How positive are you with looking for things that help you get better?